So, welcome to this video. I've just experimented a little bit with the reshader program EXA with Fallout and realized and pray and realized that I can put that into a lot of different games. So I'm trying that right now with, with Outriders, first of all, and maybe Rocket League. But if I press position one on my keyboard after downloading that, I have here some reshade selections. Okay, it's going to be difficult to find right now. Um, yep, yeah, that's already not like I wanted to. Where the hell am I? Fallout New Vegas, LX. Nope, that's not where I want to be. Okay, Epic Games. Reshaders. There. There and there are my reshaders. Had to find that first. And then I can pop in some reshaders. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I thought. <laughs> and play my oh it's running smooth now it, my game is running smooth now and now i can play my game with three shades on and it might not all look that good this is the stray reshade i used for some stray videos <laughs> this looks cursed as all hell okay let's try some other ones this game does not need any reshades by the way but i've have to experience that this is a little bit too bright but this reshade is called bright realism anyways there are different versions of that all of them are probably way too bright for this game yeah definitely definitely let's not use that um stalker misery that's one of my favorites oh what the hell did i just do oh yeah yeah this reshade is amazing it's like a well more drastic cinematic sad movie reshade apocalyptic reshade the from the stalker franchise inspired this definitely looks good on everything's out right so far even pray then what else do i have i've downloaded a fallout reshade um circ cinematic circ cinematic why not that first eh. Like I said, not everything will work with every game. Some brightnesses are just too high. The Jedi Fallen Order one. That's decent looking. God damn it. I'm always pressing the wrong key here. I don't know. It's too bright too. It's too bright. Everything too bright is messing up the game a little bit. I feel like... Yeah, a lot of different... True realistic reshade for Fallout. Is that a folder? That is a folder. Um, I don't know which one is the right one. Oh, yeah. Okay, this one. That one looks also pretty good. So, I've tried Overwatch. Overwatch does not work. Maybe multiplayer mods, do, um, games don't work. Maybe it's just in the wrong root folder, directionary. But I don't want shaders in Overwatch anyways. I actually don't want shaders in this game too. I feel like this game is just too good looking basically for shaders but now I ruined it and now I'll forever play this game with shaders on. Um, Cancel. Yeah you should know where your default shader is which I don't know where my default shader is. I feel like worst case scenario you can just de-click everything and get the normal game again. Rip, 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 yep. Yeah. And the normal game works again. Okay, let me show you how that actually would look like if you do that like me. Okay, okay, let's get the basics down. What you need for this to work. So I've made myself, first of all, when I experimented with Fallout, a reshades folder here with all the reshades. I pretty much copied that for myself into my PC data e that's where i have all my games in and made myself this reshade basic folder so i have the reshade setup exit here which you'll need and some different mods or reshaders which you get linked by me of course that's the reshade mod that you can download and need to download to make this work you activate it then with position one 
those are some of the resheets I used. The Cirque Cinematic one, the real D 3D one, that's the trippy one. That's the cool looking Fallout 4 one, the bright one, that also looked pretty good. And this is the Stalker Misery one, which also looked pretty cool, the apocalyptic one. I'm gonna link that. So, so if you downloaded that, then you open it up with double click, you get some exit files you can work with. And do you need to select the game you want to work with then? Like Fallout, Mass Effect, I have too many mods on that, I can't experiment with that at all. I've done Prey, which you will see in a previous video, and Fallout 3. And now we're gonna do Rocket Lake. Um, yeah, next then, then normally you get something pre-selected, if there's nothing pre-selected, I would recommend that. But if nothing is pre-selected, this might be also a little bit cursed. You can get something as a preset which you don't need. Skip that. Uncheck all. Check all so you get the full package. Next. And then you just work it. You work it. You wait. You wait till it finished working. That's what you do. Take a big sip of water, finish first, and then you start the game. Where's Rocket League? Rip. I don't have too many games installed right now, but this should work with a lot of single player games anyways. I've used it in Stray, for example. That's where most of those mods come from. Okay, starting up Rocket League. Uh, if it would start, okay, now it's starting. If it would start quickly. I would not recommend that for multiplayer games. You see on the top screen that the reshader program is working. On my German keyboard, I activate that with position one. Then, on my on your English keyboard, it might be the home key. Okay, let's get into a training lobby. Now training's not funny. Um, extra. I actually I can show you right now, real quick. Bright realism. Okay, I need to back all the way back into my main data e folder. Otherwise, it's gonna be com too complicated. So I don't need to put that the reshaders in every game folder because you gonna open the game folder where your Rocket League X is. And let's just throw on Misery. Yeah. Like I said, now you have the Misery experience. Um, You can play online games like that, but I'm just gonna get myself a Freundschaftsspiel. Oh yeah, sure, give me a good map. Team Jetta, Spiel Modus Play, Arena, no, I want, I want a good one. I want a good one. What's a good one? There aren't no good ones. Where's Starbase? Where's Starbase? Come on. I just want Starbase. Nope. There. There. Spiel erstellen. And then I can mess around in here. Look at that. Okay. A breath start. Yes. It pauses. Done. Let's try a different one. The 3D one, which is messy as all hell. Ah, oh, yes. Yes. <laughs> oh. oh, God. I need to do content like that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. Too bad Rocket League subreddit already banned me. <laughs> oh, <why not? laughs> if I would have hit it that. Oh, I love that reshade. I love that reshade when it works. Okay, 3D. Let's go back. Bright. Bright realism is probably too bright for this game. Yeah, definitely the other ones are way too bright. Anyways, the real realistic reshade should be working pretty fine. Nothing changed here. So I guess that was the wrong file. It's always an any file, but there are often 
different ini files f1 there and that's the one position one yeah that's the one that's also looking fine and the bot just scored on me so that's looking pretty fine i could just change that in the middle of the cutscene to another Zerx one um Zerx oh, that doesn't look good so not everything will good look will look good for every game that's pretty bright too good job bot good job and then we got this one which is a prey one ah it's too deep and colorful and this one and one of those two one of those twos oh boy no that's also not cool i like the 3d the most when it works oh it's always so cool looking let's shoot a quick go if we can no we can't ah oh, i love this reshade sadly it did not blow up up oh, i'm not even gonna make it nope <laughs> but yeah ah uh, i won't get my mass effect those reshades right now won't get that into my game it's gonna be too difficult <gasps> maybe no i don't have that many games installed it should work with a lot of different games uh, fallout would be also too difficult that would be too difficult i just would mess with too much like look at that that's just trippy and messy so uh, if you want that gun you probably just need to find every marked spot here and press but depress that where's misery it's easier with misery if you click misery you have a lot of check boxes here you probably just uncheck them and it's gonna be good maybe who knows maybe my game is gonna be cursed forever position one or home key no it looks normal again i have in my previous video which should be uploaded right beforehand i should have put that in bright i don't have too many games working right now as you can see so it's a little bit difficult to show with other games uh, my epic doesn't have anything installed also i might mess around with that so again i made myself a data e pre reshade folder with different reshades in the files i'll back out to that folder and then activate some of the different reshaders here which you just need to download this it's an exe file automatically most reshade mods are either zip files or zip folders or raw folders where you need a 7 zip to unlock that that's the trippy one that's the cool one that was the other circle one which is a cinematic one that's a fallout 4 one that's a fallout 3 one so it's just any fast and it works let's try one more thing i hope that would work too i don't need my controller okay let's see filter here loot anwenden durchsuchen maybe this does also work here um data -y. probably not it's probably something else obs where is it reshades misery reshaders textures hmm hmm multi load no lens uh, i feel like i see a little bit of difference i probably need to turn that down all the way nope not doing that much dirt png but i'm trying that on my webcam right now that confuses you way more than it should be i'm sorry stalker let's try the 3d one ah sadly nothing here to select through textures there we got some more textures yeah no it doesn't seem like it's gonna do much here with my face cam sadly 
I would love the 3D effect on my face cam. Okay, okay, okay. Finish. Thanks for watching. Things should be linked. And peace out.